Hi, I'm Brian from Northwest Bronco, and today I'm going to show you one way to season your Roan pie irons. If this is your first time using pie irons, you may not know that these pie irons are not good to cook right out of the box. First, you have to season them. All right, so let's talk about what you're going to need. First of all, go outside and fire up your barbecue. Then, get your pie irons, a box of latex gloves, and a thing of vegetable shortening from Crisco. Now when you get your pyre irons, they come with a layer of wax on them, so we're going to go ahead and burn that off first. So you want to preheat your barbecue to between 400 and 450 degrees. Separate your pyre irons. Put them right over the fire. We're going to go ahead and leave those in there for about 15 minutes, flipping halfway. Okay, once your 15 minutes is up, go ahead and take them off the grill and let them cool. Okay, while the pyrons are still warm, you're going to go ahead and get yourself some uh, real mild soapy water and give them a scrub. And that is just going to get the rest of the wax off. Okay, once you've gotten all the wax scrubbed off there, go ahead and dry them off thoroughly. Okay, our next step is going to be to put on our latex gloves and apply the Crisco. You just want to rub it all over the cast iron, every nook and cranny. Okay, once you have the Crisco all over your cast iron, you're going to go ahead and cook them for 15 minutes, flipping halfway, and then you're going to repeat that step four times. Okay, we're done with our first 15 minutes. And you can see that the irons are already starting to turn kind of a nice uh, golden brown. Now we're going to go ahead and set these off to the side and we're going to let them cool. And then we're going to reapply more Crisco and repeat the process. And then we'll come back to see the end result. And when we're done, they should be nice and, and black and kind of a glossy, glossy black color. All right, time is up. We have done uh, four rounds, 15 minutes uh, around, flipping halfway each time, um, applying uh, Crisco each time we uh, every 15 minutes. So see how we turned out. Now oh, those are perfect. See how they're nice and black? So they go from the color that they come in to kind of an amber brown, and they're done when they get to be kind of a black color like this. So we're gonna go ahead and take these off, let them cool. And then I'm going to show you the final step. Okay, now we're at our final step. Now, now once they've cooled down, uh, the vegetable shortening that's on there pretty much sticks to it. So you don't have, they may be glossy and black, um, but they're not slimy at all or greasy at all. They're just, they're nice and so, you know, nothing comes off my finger at all. Uh, so the final step is going to get some high temperature cooking spray. This is kind of what you're going to use um, when you're cooking with these anyway, but high temperature and you're just going to give them a little spray. that is it. Maybe I'll give them a little wipe off just to get the excess oil off, but that's how you do it. I like to keep my pie irons kind of protected and also it keeps them from rattling around my, in my vehicle um, by getting the Rome uh, little covers. And it's, they're pretty cool. They're kind of burlap material and then they just slide right in. Just like this. And they have little buttons down here to hold them on and they also have little hangers. So anyway, Hopefully this helps you with uh, how to season your pie irons. If you like the video, please give it a like. Maybe subscribe to my channel for more content, and I'll see you next time.